Hey there, Libra. Welcome. This is a daily energy check-in. Quick tarot read. Just a little quick tarot deck, small one. I'm using the White Sage Tarot. It's uh, my favorite travel deck. I love this deck. Spirit, can you talk to me about Libra? Uh, in Vedic astrology, we're just coming out of Libra season. Um, in Western astrology, we're in Scorpio season. We just were in Libra, so. Happy birthday to my Vedic Libras. Yeah. What, what do we have for, uh, what's the overall energy for Libra today? What can Libra expect this day? Queen of Swords. Truthful information. Quick cutting truthful information. Queen of Swords, she uh, doesn't take no guff. You know what I mean? Uh, could also be, you know, air sign, like yourself. It's queen, showing up in your own reading, up front. Um, air sign feminine. Uh, you know, it could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Could be you. I'm gonna see it as, it as you. Right on, you showed me putting your own ingredient. I like it. And your feminine power. You know your stuff, but you don't gotta flaunt it. You know the things, but you don't gotta lord it over them. Got it. So for Libra, what do we have? What else, what other energies are around our Libra this day? The Hanged Man. So, Monarch Butterfly. Another regal butterfly. That's a monarch one. Going into that J shape means they're about to form, uh, form their uh, their chrysalis, so they can their cocoon, their chrysalis, so they can do their molting thing. And they come out of it completely different. That's what the hangman does. They uh, hang themselves upside down. No, it's not literally. It's for a new perspective, for a metamorphosis. Change your mind. Change your perspective. You change your reality. So, it's about a change in perspective. What else do we have for Libra, this, this change perspective? What's this perspective they're changing? What's this about? Come on, Spirit, what do we got? Play with you, play with me. What are these cards about? Uh, you know, I like to see a single popper. That's it. It's about a King of Wands. It's about a fire sign masculine energy. Um, could be you, could be someone you know. To change perspective about this swervy king of wands. Good looking son of a gun. Has energy, knows how to get things done. Um, creative energies. What else we got? What do we got there, spirit? What can you tell me for Libra on this day? About dealing with this king of wands that they're changing their perspective on. It's about the fool and your journey moving forward. Taking that leap, puppy with a stick, going for it. Happy as can be. You know it, that childlike mind. Yeah, the child's mind. You must come again as a child to enter the kingdom of heaven. This is the kingdom of heaven. And if you have a childlike mind, you're already there. Letting go of the baggage. That's that new perspective, it's letting go of that baggage. Ooh, three of wands. So, preparing to act. It's a card of preparation. They say it's the card of waiting, but you're not just sitting around twiddling your thumbs waiting, you're preparing, preparing to act. What else do we have for Libra on this day? What's this all about? What's it all about, spirit? Oh, it's about the Eight of Cups. It's about walking away. Got it. Okay, you've changed your perspective on that King of Wands, on that masculine fire sign energy. You've changed that perspective. You made that fool's leap of, ah, I'm going. I'm a going, I'm going, and I'm gone. Walking away from something that wasn't satisfying you, something that was leaving you feeling 
unsatisfied or unfulfilled. Well, put space, put distance. You know? Leave in those eight cups, because you're going to go find your nine cups somewhere else. Yes, you are. Keep going, Libra. You got this. This is, this is about you. Yeah. That's right. You don't have to heal everybody in this world. Put those burdens down. That's right. The Ten of Wands. Walking away and you're putting down that bundle. You're putting down those burdens. That's good. Good for you, Libra. If you've been wondering, should I do that or not? Yeah, Libra, it's there. It's in the cards, at least these cards. That is, if this resonates for you. If it doesn't, you know, click off. Not gonna hurt my feelings. I, I mean, I like having you here, don't get me wrong. But I only want you here if it's working for you, okay? Don't be in an illusion about this. Seven of Cups. Look for what's real. Make sure that it's real. Make sure that you're feeling it here. <sighs> feel into it. Always feel into it first. Yep. What else we got for Libra? Let's go lead you Ten of Pentacles. Mm hmm Ten of Pentacles. Generational wealth can also be the completion of a pentacle cycle for you. So, and when one ends, a new begins. It's the ten. So you'll be able to then, you know, if you leave one job, you're already starting another. You're closing out how you got the pentacles one way, now you're moving into a new series of pentacles, a new series of physical wealth. Yeah, good for you. Good for you, Libra. Uh, one last message, Spirit. Any, any last message of advice for our Libras? What do we have for our Libra collective? King of Cups. Balance your emotions. Stabilize your emotions. Definitely. Own your emotions. Don't be afraid of them. Allow yourself into them. But don't get lost in them. King of Cups. Could also be a uh, masculine um, water sign like Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Could be that. I always saw the King of Cups as Scorpio myself, but it can be any of the water signs. Wow. So it's a daily reading, and that's what I got for you, Libra. Hope this helps. Mm. Sending you so much love. Uh, if you like the video, click like, you know, hit the uh, you know, thumbs up thing. Um, leave me a comment. I'd like to hear you. I'd like to hear what you think. If you get something out of it, check back. Let me know. Like, hey, man, that kind of happened in my day. It was weird. Um, if you like the way I do this, click subscribe. It helps me build the channel and helps me get my messages out to more people. And uh, then I tap into a larger collective. Hmm. Thank you very much, Libra. Have a beautiful rest of your day. Love you.